Was I just singing? Mommy! You do not call me that! Slow down, little one. I am not your mother. But, Mommy... Will you quit calling me Mommy? <laughs> I called it. If there's two things I hate in this world, it's cockroaches and crying babies. I agree. Come now, little one. I'll help you out of here. But that's all. Side quests. And you have to promise there'll be no crying. A single tear and you'll be crying alone. Got it? Okay, mommy. Wait a minute. Is this going to be an escort mission? Because I hate escort missions. This is Rico. I'm back just picking up where I left off with uh, Bayonetta. Uh, it is Saturday afternoon and while I'm making lunch and it is cooking in the kitchen and uh, I don't really have to, I can set it and forget it, I might as well, you know, do another round of uh, Bayonetta. So, um, uh, this will be chapter six or chapter V, which is VI, uh, but uh, is, you know, are they going to start explaining anything, you know, so, the, so that the story makes sense. Who knows? Maybe they'll wait until the very last chapter to explain everything, you know, as, as you do. Or maybe the explanation will be dumb and make no sense, like in Lost. But uh, in any case, let's uh, get into it. Let us waste no further time. I gotta get into the game. I grab my controller. Your laws are very unclear. The Gates of Paradise. Sure. See, the loading screen is so short, I, I really can't do anything. It's raining in the game. It's also raining outside. You gotta look around, man. You never know what you're gonna find. Another quarter disc. These pieces are getting smaller and smaller. How come I can't turn into that jaguar thing? Oh, there we go. There's people here? Entering Vigrid. Did I already leave Vigrid? I didn't even try to do that. There's no need in fighting if I can retreat and fire at the same time. I can't tell. Are those things limited? 
Because I used two of them in a row. Gotta do the time thing again, don't I? Where's the statute? Statute. Statue! That almost did it. Let's try that again. I'm wicked smart. Still don't know why we care about this little girl. Also, she's not in the shadow realm like we are, so she should be safe. Terrible shape, restoring it should be easy, man. I'm standing put till one of them decides to attack. Fall already so that I can attack this guy. All your halos are belong to us. Okay, they can jump out of the water, so maybe I should get out of it. Come at me, brah. I missed it. I missed it again. Agra what? Oh, it's the indigestion thing. I get it. But what I keep forgetting to do is to bash the X button! You know, I've suddenly lost my appetite. Okay, now I can use the statue things to slow down time to run on water. I think.
Super long hallway! Tiny little girl. Still don't know why we care about her. camera. I'm gonna try to run straight ahead. What are the odds are gonna let me use that time thing again? Okay, this time I need it to last much longer. Ha. Dang it! Alright, gonna have to find another way to do this. There's no way to avoid this one. I brought me all the way over here just to figure that out. Here's a question. How come the little, the little girl didn't have to go through all this? One hit and I lose my... I think I gotta do it all in one go. It's gonna be harder than it looks. This thing is shiny. This doesn't have anything to do with anything? There we go.
Finally! One, two... Dang it! Notes on the topic of magic, volume four, or volume IV in English. I was mashing X, thinking that that would do something, but no! I gotta do the other thing. I keep picking up the weapons that they drop. I don't know if they help. Here's an idea. How about you step out of this weird shadow realm where these angels are attacking you, and you go to the realm where the little girl is, where there's nothing attacking you, and you can just yell at her and say, Hey, stop right there! I want answers! Guys, I got all day, and my bullets are unlimited. I got no reason not to shoot you. It's Big Bertha! I thought it would be a monster, but I guess it's just a chasm. Human form is in red. I wonder if that is a clue as to what I should do. Would you hit him already? Isn't it? Are you hiding something from me? Come on. Like I said, beautiful, ridiculous. I don't get it. Oh dear. Save the cheerleader, save the world. Someone tells me I'm going to regret this. My sweet 
I'm getting real sick of this guy. She's probably the key to whatever plans this guy has. As opposed to what you've been doing before? So is this yet a third realm that we've never seen before? Or was that just either of the realms in the... And what's with the Frank Sinatra? You do not call me that. Slow down, little one. I am not your mother. But, mommy. Will you quit calling me mommy? <laughs> I called it. <laughs> oh. If there's two things I hate in this world, it's cockroaches and crying babies. I agree. Well, a crying baby cockroach would be truly terrible. So don't you dare cry. Yes, Mommy. Fine. You've got to be a strong little one to survive in a place like this. Where are we? What's your name, anyway? Ceresa. Ceresa? You're not from Figrid, are you, little one? Where are you from? She's got a British accent. Well now, I'll hazard a guess this isn't your home. So what on earth are you doing here? My daddy told me to come here. I wonder if he's the one who's been whispering in your ear. He was at work, but now I don't know where he's going. I want to go home. I can't just drag you along wherever I go, someone. So you better not be getting attached to me. Yes, mommy. Oh. Come now, little one. I'll help you out of here. But that's all. Side quests! And you have to promise there'll be no crying. A single tear and you'll be crying alone. Got it? Okay, mommy. Wait a minute. Is this going to be an escort mission? Because I hate escort missions. Does she have her own life meter? Oh, for crap's sake, she does. And I lost her. Nope, there she is. How's she going to cross the chasms I'm going to be headed to? This don't make no sense. And I don't even know where I'm supposed to go. And all the doors are closed. Lord of the skies, it is I, Thorax the Impaler. This door is bigger than the others. Obviously. We turn right. OK, 
Okay, there's no way through that. Uh, hey, little kid, tornado, go back inside. I can't tell if I'm making any progress. Would you stop hitting the kid? She's gonna die, because I'm not making any progress against these things. I gotta put some distance between me and her, so... Okay, at least her health goes up. That's good. Is there a way for me to get into the nether realm? That took way too much effort. You are useless. Thought there'd be something in the dumpster. I guess not. Break the fence, but not that wood, eh? Is there any chance that I can turn down the camera controls? Because they are so slippery. Camera speed. Let's give that a try. I don't even know where I am right now. I can't seem to move forward. I can't tell where I am. This kid's gonna die. And I'm out of things I can throw. She's dead, isn't she? Hey, why is the game over? I didn't die. She died.
That's her problem. The shadow, the shadow is gonna have to get over it because I didn't die. My paranoia is kicking in. Nope, we're good. Pick this thing up, and then throw it! Pick this thing up, and then throw it! I'm supposed to keep going, that's what it is. Forget you! I can barely figure out what I'm supposed to do! Oh man, she came with. Hey. This is probably how you got lost to begin with. She got lost. Mommy. Don't worry. It's always scary the first time you see them. So, where was I? I'm just as annoyed as she is. Your kind invitation? I do hope you've prepared dessert as well. A lovely tea party. And dancing, too. Cereza, my dear, watch and learn. These things are still invisible, which means I can't hurt them. I wish you could issue commands to this kid to be like, stay here, where there's cover. Uh, am I supposed to go toward that thing? You stay here. Invisible walls.
Good. Kill her. What? Uh, well, who, what? Are we bringing the bird back? Point of order. Point of order, not that I'm asking for it, but the fact is, is they've already established that every time she summons one of those things, it's made out of her hair, which is what her outfit is made out of. Which is why, you know, I mean, I'm sure the game programmers decided to write it this way so that there would be plenty of opportunities to, you know, have these revealing scenes where she applies her hair to something else. But, in this instance where it's attacking this creature and then she catches the kid, shouldn't she therefore be naked? Again, I'm not asking for that, but a little consistency here. A single scene where she can use it for more than one thing. That would be nice. But then that would take away the excuse of, you know, partial nudity. What am I attacking today? Right now? Oh, we're doing the whole Ocean's Eleven thing? Okay, am I supposed to go this way? Bullet! See, kid, there's your mom. Now can beat it. What is this, a Vogue contest? Would you please shoot each other already? The only audience you two have is a little kid! Joy? You know what? I might just drop this game. 
because it's only gonna get weirder from here, right? That was needlessly provocative and grotesque. Hey, did we lose the kid? We lost the kid! That's awesome! Yay! Yay! Air Force Base? Oh yeah, there's the Air Force Base. Oh gee whiz, I wonder if this bridge is gonna get destroyed. Good. You found Dad. You can leave her with him. Mommy, you're a mom. You? Come now, Cheshire. Look at me. Do I look like I have any interest in children? Now making them. Well, that's another story. Whoa, whoa! You're getting the wrong idea. I mean, it might be the right idea, but... I'm trying to kill you. Right now, right? Right? Yeah, uh, speaking of right, I'm glad I've been standing around waiting for you, because I knew we'd cross paths. Because I'm still trying to kill you. The only way to reach the upper crust in their gated island of champagne wishes and caviar dreams is over Prominence Bridge. Oh, yes. The island. Lovely place, isn't it? Oh, now what? Don't play games with me. You've worked your magic on this poor defenseless child, haven't you? You're a sad, sick woman, you know that? I was her age when you killed my father. Wait. No, you couldn't. Oh my god, you did, didn't you? You killed her parents! Hmm. Come to think of it, she's better off with you. You two are more hassle than you're worth. What? Just keep a good eye on her, or you're going to catch hell for it. No good deed goes unpunished, and you never know when a monster may sneak up on you. Speak of the devil. I called it. Mommy, no. I'm Batman. I'm swinging away on my grappling hook, which I hooked on something. How could anyone see you? How could any of them feel anything? This is still unexplained. But you know what? I can think about that on another day. Because this chapter is over. And that death was not my death. It was the kid's death. That shouldn't even count. Shut up, Cheshire. That should be a gold medal. Injuru Itakuru!
Convert them all. Because I can't buy a thing. The Cardinal Virtue of Temperance. Chapter VEE! -E. That's actually just VEE. -E. Because VEE -E would be 8. Save. Let us take a moment to reflect. The kid recognizes her as mommy, so... <laughs> Our main character has amnesia, so why not trust the child? Uh, but she's, what, four by her height? She might be a little older. Uh, so Bayonetta can't be her child because she's been buried for like 20... Wait, no. She was buried for who knows how long uh, under this river. And then she's been searching for her memory, I think, for the past 20 years. So she could have had this child at any point after that. But she doesn't remember it. And this was post-amnesia. So I'm trying to figure it out. And it's getting worse and worse and worse. Uh, and so I'm getting more and more frustrated as the, ga as the game goes on. Uh... This Cheshire Luca guy keeps showing up, and it's a constant, uh, I'm gonna get you for killing my dad! Uh, and then, hey, you know, you always seem to keep showing up, and, uh, you always seem to be the cause of trouble, and she saves, Bayonetta saves him and the kid, and she says she doesn't care about either, uh, about either of them. So, you know, beyond it not making any sense, it's, it's, Act, it's not just passively not making sense. It is actively confusing. But uh, I'm going to keep playing? I don't know. I was I was plenty disturbed by that, uh, that bit with the doppelganger. Uh, it was very uh, suggestive. And so, you know, the, the, the whole, you know, partial nudity teasing thing, that, that I knew was part of the game. But that, that bit with the chains... <clears throat> it's only going to get worse, right? So if I keep playing, maybe I should just drop it now. I'll play it by ear. But if, you know, if that's the kind of thing that's to be expected to go on, you know, I, I don't know that I can keep promoting or, or, or playing this game. So put it on the shelf for now, re, you know, revisit it later. Hopefully it doesn't come up at all. Uh, but if it does, yeah, I'll drop the game. I'll, I'll uninstall it on that basis alone. So uh, it is what it is. That's uh, it for today. My lunch is probably ready. You guys take care and God bless.